The first time you open Posture Screen Mobile, you're going to be prompted with this settings page for your clinic information. If you're a personal trainer, um, that's fine. Just use your information for the clinic location or your gym membership for the clinic location. Uh, you're going to want to put an email address where you want the blind carbon copies sent. Okay, this is not necessarily the email address that it's sending from, so you got to make sure that you associate the right address uh, with your device. If you have more than one email address, make sure you send from that email address. But this is where you want the uh, documents blind carbon copy to make sure that your staff or for backup, you get them sent to your email. Then you're going to put in your clinic information and also, by the way, this is your clinic letterhead information. So just as, so you can see how to set this, if I don't have a clinic logo in there, it's going to default with this information in text on the report. So what I want to do is if I want to hit photo, it's going to open up my photo library, okay, and I can just open up. Um, I'll just open up all my photos and hold on one second while this opens up. I want to make sure that I get it in the right area. Okay, so here is you can see I have a whole bunch of photos and if I click my clinic logo or my I should say my former clinic logo, I'm just going to pan it in here and I'm just going to crop it down just a little bit. Okay, so you can see there's my clinic logo. I just hit save. Okay, and now that logo shows up and that's what's going to be at the top of the uh, header information. Okay, so now what I put here is not going to show up, but it's important and you must have this filled out anyway. Okay, special event on the next release when we're going to have uh, integration of web exercises like we do with the Apple iOS version. Okay, the next thing that you can do is if you want to put a password in for password P, uh, protected PDFs, you can. I'm going to go ahead and put one in. It's just going to be CBP for chiropractic biophysics, but you put your own. This is important that you're, what you're going to put in here is important because that is going to be what um, is the master password should you choose to use the PDF uh, document encryption. Okay, so let me go back to the settings here. If we go back to the settings screen, then what we're going to see here is that we can change the sound when we go ahead and click things. Um, these are all self-explanatory. We can choose uh, customary US or metric. Um, if we want to connect to Dropbox, which I suggest you do because it's a great syncing tool. And then here we have the offset. What the heads up display is by default is at 15 degrees. That means when the device is perfectly vertical that would be off or zero degrees. As you stand up you may want to tilt the device towards the subject and that horizontal line that's going to show when you take the camera picture that's going to be set at 15 degrees and it's going to show level. So you have to choose an experiment based on your height what setting that you would want. Okay. If you're doing this clinically I would have it off and I would be on your knee taking a picture mostly of the midpoint of their body, their pelvis. Um, but as long as you're consistent that's the main idea from picture to picture. So if you do a pre-post, you want to be consistent. Here, this is the manufacturer and all the device information. If we, if you ever call support or write in a support and we ask you what type of device you have, you could simply just hit send device information and it's going to ask you, we can send it, you know, via email and it's going to open up email and send it to us, right? So I'm on a Galaxy Nexus. Let me just go ahead and go back here and go back here. Alright, so um, that's how you do the settings and that is, needs to be set up before you do your first posture assessment. For more information, I want you to go ahead and email us at info at postureco, that's postureco.com.